Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Crusader Kings 2 and our Frisian Coast campaign. We are dealing with another uh, host army that is attacking. We are about, uh, I think, 55 years, give or take, away from uh, getting the good old days uh, achievement. Uh, once these two fall into our Dijur Kingdom. And we are basically one war away from getting the Frisian Coast achievement. Uh, when we get Ruin. I don't think you need Vexen for it, but uh, it's possible. I still want Vexen. I also want Sens, and I want Vendome, and just for the heck of it, I kind of want Venison and uh, Procolier, or however it's pronounced. But I'm not going to really work too hard on getting those. Anyway, uh, let's go ahead and get back into it. Take care of this uh, army that's spawned here. Uh, my Ermacinde and I had s almost stopped talking to each other when Chancellor Duke Gerbrand intervened. He made Ermacinde start talking to me, even like me a little bit more. Such good work should be rewarded. 26 gold? Or he only did his job. Yeah, let's make him like me more. I'll pay some money. Oh no, I'm not even at an even 1700. It's fine. <laughs> there we go, victory there. Let's see, what are you doing? You are defending against a holy war for Gascony against Germany, which what does Germany have this? Yeah, I guess so, okay. I'm amused that uh, Oxtens are uh, controlling Germany. There we go, we are at 100%. Offer peace. Uh, enforce demands. You have 600 gold. Oh, I'm going to have to banish you now. Thank you. down in Burgundy now. Alright. Uh, let's see. Basically need to get you over here. Actually, nope, I need to go take care of them. completely wiped them out. All right. So, I do have almost 12k troops. You know, I think we do it now. your claim on Rouen. Uh, I actually don't need to spend anything anymore. Uh, he's not at war. Did he lose it? I don't think so. Nah, it doesn't look like it. Is your claim on Rouen. There we go. 
I have enough to uh, hire some mercenaries if I so desire. Or if I feel that I need. Okay. Get up here. Get up there. You guys all get there. Maybe go through this county. <laughs> there we go. Let's see how this goes. Ah, shoot. Well, we're getting into some little skirmishes, unfortunately. Eh, it'll be okay. Uh, the monument promised by Duke Wigbald is finished. Upon unveiling, a statue of yourself is revealed, and you notice the crowd smiling and giving you a round of applause. I have no words. Gain 200 uh, prestige. Uh, I like him more. It's too much. Remove it. I'll take the 200 prestige. You're gonna stop moving, so we'll go kill you. Could have tried uh, sweeping up some guys, but eh. Uh, let's see. End your plot. Thank you. Over there. And then go up there. Let's see, I can you can end your plot. There we go. End some more plots. Also, let's close that out so that it's not under there all the time. It kind of annoys me. Apparently one of the courtiers has been annoying my wife. Instead of asking me for help, she took the matter in her own hands and made sure the courtier would never annoy her again or he'd know the consequences. What on earth was she thinking? Well, he already hates me. So, um, yeah, she did the right thing. This war isn't going quite as I thought it would. I lose more men per battle than I'd planned, and the sieges? The sieges are going on forever. More manpower and more siege weapons are what I need. Perhaps a friend could assist me with this. <laughs> yes. Let's ask the, the wicked priest, uh, renowned physician, with 767 troops to join the war. Um, give me some money. Yeah, give me some money. <laughs> it's probably going to be like two gold. Ripped pillows, broken furniture, shattered vases. My marriage to Ermesinde has devolved into an unending torment of bitter arguments and fiery rows. I would be depressed, but my lover, Aliarde, just suggested that we retire to the countryside for a few days of carefree romance and passion. What a splendid idea. Or I can't. The Watcher, he sees all. Because I have the lunatic trait. Oh, yeah, what a splendid idea. I have, uh, I get health plus one. I can usurp the. I can usurp the. Uh, 
Jarldom of Yeland. I think I will probably want to do that. Do you have any kids? Oh my god, do you have kids? Uh, also, how did you marry her? I do not know. Okay, uh, then what I think we will do is, uh... I don't know what it is, but you don't look quite Norse, sir. I'm trying to put my finger on exactly what it is about your, your face. It's not really getting that Norse Viking vibe from me. Let's go ahead and usurp that. Alright, who do we want to give it to? Giving it to you would... Oh. Oh, did I screw this up and give you... Give it to a Lombard? I screwed it up and gave it to a Lombard, didn't I? You're Frisian, at least. Alright, well, let's give it to you so that hopefully you will die. And if not... Uh... You hate me. Dear Bishop Throncrick, I'm I'm pretty sure that uh, oh, yep. Yeah. Dear Bishop Throncrick, my duties to my family and my vassals disallow me to help you at this moment. I hope the war will turn to your favor, and I wish for you to win the war quickly, with hopes of understanding your friend, Bishop Throncrick. Something tells me that he's lying. It's, I don't know, just a little little niggling thing that. Uh, I think he may be lying to me. I think he may be lying to me. I must have chosen the wrong guy for this. Uh, oh well. Let's see. You are... No. Learn on your own. And go ahead and get a diplomatic focus. And assign guardian. There we go. Stupid raiders. Get out of here. Oh, well, there's a 10,000 uh, man army coming up towards me. Or, you know, not coming up towards me, going to one of my lands. Oh, 17.5, alright. Well, let's go ahead and uh, get as much of this as we can. Uh, I have a new heir, who is Frisian. Uh, he has cancer, though, so he will probably die. Let's see. You are Frisian. That's good. You died in the dungeons of Duke Silef of Benevento. Uh, niece and just a member of my dynasty. So I need some... Uh, Kids, you're Lombard, unfortunately. But we got a Frisian on the uh, on the throne there. Nope, oh, you're coming up. Are you gonna? Nope, you're going over to Vexen. No, no. Oh my lord, he took a major river crossing to attack me. Whoa! Wow! Look at their their uh, their morale just a disintegrated, just melted away. How much was that worth? 54%. Holy cow. You know what? I'm just going to assault here. I got 10.8% here. 
Uh, my liege, I'm pleased to report my su the success of my mission to Bremen. Uh, the majority of the population have been converted to the Catholic faith. Excellent. And we do have a dangerous faction now, because I lost a few troops. Let's head up there. This was under Saxony. What happened? Uh, conquered in the war. Ah. There's a Danish revolt going on. Kind of wish you could uh, click on someone and see how close they were to getting a, uh, a certain title, like a, a kingdom or a, an empire title. Holy cow! Dude, you are so good. And unfortunately, I can't move you now. Alright, let's see. These two... Oh, and actually, uh, Yolinda's already been converted. So, it's just these two. Works for me. And... What are we doing on culture? Nothing has been converted to, uh... Fr oh, no, actually, we have gotten some conver some Frisian conversions. It's still Norse. I love this right here, that this is Norse. That's, that's just too fantastic. Alright, well, uh, we have gotten some uh, Frisian conversions, so that is good. Unfortunately, we've got uh, quite a bit of Dutch down here. Got another keep built. Son was born. Uh, you are not going to have anything just yet. Uh, Jordan. And he will be legitimized. And I will, uh, I will make him a Frisian when the time comes. He's just going to sit down there in uh, Troyes for now. There's no man better at increasing the church's opinion of me or teach me how to become a more pious man than my court chaplain, Hugus. Uh, the church approves. Uh, temple vassal opinion plus 25. Temple vassal opinion plus 25. I'll take that. Okay. 88%. We're getting a ticking war score. Let's head down here. I'm okay. The wife of Kagan Moses of Ratatot has been spending a few days in Bruges. It has been a very nice experience meeting her. Maybe our peoples are not that different after all. That eh, changes nothing. Well, it seems like you're getting your butt kicked, so... Uh... Well, okay, maybe not. Just that county there. He is Hungarian. He's in three wars. He has a crap ton of children. To improve your stewardship and to better learn how to administrate a realm, it strikes you that it might be a good idea to conduct a survey of the land. Sure, I've just, I, you know, like the previous guy just did this, but I'll definitely do that. Uh, that'll be plus two uh, um, stewardship if it works. Hello! How's it going? Just careful, don't care. Mmm, mmm, 3,000, 3,000, thank you, mine, my land, it's all mine, unfortunately you are now a vassal, that is less than good, 
Let's go take care. Actually, uh, before I do that, I'll disband my vassal levies, so I'm not getting that anymore. Alright, so you are under him. I'd kind of rather make this guy the uh, one, but then she would be stuck under uh, Brittany. I can hold a feast. Do still have that. I can groom an heir because you died. You were Frisian. It's kind of okay, but on the other hand, you're now Anglo Saxon and everything. No, I've got uh, I've got two sons, two more sons. After being skillfully treated by court physician uh, Chenonai of Midrahi, my lover Aliarde is feeling much better. Perhaps he is deserving of some praise. What? Huh? Are, are you my? Oh, yeah. Ashkenazi Jew. All right, yeah. Um. Go ahead and have 4.3 gold. I don't care. Alright, I have a lot of uh, people with low opinions of me, unfortunately. All right, you lost your noble scepter. Uh, we've got a new guy in charge here. Uh, we'll try to remember to educate you. Uh, let's go ahead and grant land a title, Duchy of Normandy. There we go. Okay. So I don't think that I got the uh, achievement. I did not. Disband. So, do I need... No, because it specifically is Leon to Yiland. I have it all now. I mean, except for Vexen. It shouldn't matter because it's not on the coast. Maybe it's a, a year thing, no? arrived at my court. Now let's uh, matrilineally marry you a to someone like uh, this commander. Alright. Let me uh, let me pop down the speed a little bit and take a quick look. Because maybe I do need Vexen. Which is okay. More money to the church. You died under suspicious circumstances. Eh, whatever. Hmm. Alright, let's pull up the wiki. Let's search for achievements. Raiders have arrived in Iprin. Let's go ahead and do that. Alright, so achievements. And it is. Let's just search for Frisian. Uh, okay. Uh, 
Alright, uh... Yeah, you don't actually need these down here. Doesn't look like you actually need Chele either. Um, but... Yeah. Huh. I don't know. Uh, you don't have to be Frisian culture to do it. You just have to be king of Frisia. Hmm. Go, took care of them. Looks like we got some more coming in. Ugh. Raise up here. Come up here. Get out of here. Bump up the speed a bit. And we'll raise up the uh, troops here just to make it. Even more. Well, hello. Uh, do you want him back? Nope. Get that. Alright, well, uh, it is about time to end the episode anyway. Um, part of the problem I'm looking at with the uh, uh, achievement is that it recommend it has like a recommended starting time to make it easier, which isn't all that much fun. Um, but it recommends uh, starting with Charlemagne, at which case you already have, you know, all of these as it is. So it might be that you need uh, Vexen. It might be that you need the uh, individual counties. So. But I'm pretty sure you don't you don't need these. I don't know. Anyway, uh, I'll look around to see if there's uh, something else that says what you do and don't need for it. Uh, just double check. Anyway, I will see you guys in the next episode. See you then.